Let's move on to the chemical properties of zinc. Action of air. When heated in air at 773 Kelvin, it burns to form a white cloud of zinc oxide, which settles to form a woolly flock called philosopher's wool. The zinc oxide formed is called philosopher's wool. Zinc with oxygen at 773 Kelvin becomes zinc oxide. Action of air. Pure zinc does not react with water. But impure zinc, zinc with copper couple, decomposes steam quite readily evolving hydrogen gas. So zinc plus water gives zinc oxide and hydrogen. Action of dilute acids. Pure zinc is not attacked by dilute acids. However, impure zinc reacts with the dilute acids with the liberation of hydrogen. So zinc with HCl gives zinc chloride and hydrogen. Here, zinc with sulfuric acid will give zinc sulfate and hydrogen. Action of concentrated sulfuric acid. Zinc reacts with a hot concentrated sulfuric acid forming zinc sulfate. You are able to see the zinc reactions here. So, zinc with concentrated sulfuric acid, zinc sulfate, sulfur dioxide and water. Action of nitric acid. Zinc reacts with the nitric acid at various concentrations and it gives different products. Zinc plus nitric acid will give zinc nitrate and nitrous oxide and water. Similarly, if it is really dilute, it is really dilute, in that case it forms zinc nitrate and ammonium nitrate and water. Action with alkalis. Zinc dissolves in hot sodium hydroxide solution forming soluble zincate ion. Zinc plus sodium hydroxide plus water gives sodium zincate and water.